Yes, yeah, that'd be really good for China. Okay, uh, tell somebody to take you to presidential lodge. Uh, you know that time I have the presidential lodge. Because now, if you remove one plant the, and the roots are exposed, the plant, the chances of survival are very slim. Very, very slim. But if you see a, a ball of earth, you carry that ball of earth and you transplant, the, you have 100% chance of survival. So, this is why the, the, the dry season farming is different from rainy season. When the rains are there, if you transplant with the roots exposed, the plant will cease. The plant will still be not die. But if you do it during this dry season, the roots will dry up and you are likely going to lose the plant. So, in, in six, seven days' time, we will be here again to do the, that initial transplant uh, into the main nursery. By this time, a single plant in the nursery. You have so many in one nursery. But in one week's time, we we'll now do single plant nursery. One plant occupies one nursery. But if you lack land, space for plants, you can put two in, in one nursery. And then, by the time you are going to stake, they will now provide one stake for the two plants, but they will compete. And if the, any of them picks up disease, it will also hit the other one. But if a single nursery, if anyone picks up disease, the other one, they, because the other one is a little, uh, I mean a few uh, feet or meters away, it will not, the disease will not hit it. So that is uh, the thing. And uh, I hope you have learned something. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, so if you do this, you can do your dry season farming without any problem, without any heat at all. We, we now know that the weather is not very clear. It's not very clear. The system is such a way that the weather will uh, assist us or will be supportive of what we are doing. But if you handle it carelessly, as if it is during the rainy season, then you are going to lose many of your things. And it's still a cost money. You know, it's economies of production. If you say it doesn't matter, you buy seed, let's say, a seed of 5,000 naira, only for you to waste the whole thing. You have lost 5,000 naira. It's economies of production. So efficiency that we talked about the other day is minimum input with maximum output. So you put three naira, you come out with ten naira. That is agribusiness. Huh? Yes. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good morning. Sorry. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome. Well done, sir. Yes. Welcome. Welcome. Yes. Uh -huh. So, well, um, this is uh, yeah, yeah. Is in charge of the Enugu Zone. So I will leave her to introduce herself so I don't uh, make mistakes. Thank you. You're all welcome to uh, dry season farming, even though we are starting a little bit late. Yes. But I'm sure we're going to be through before the season leaves. So I'm Mrs. Ozamaka Yahaya, the area manager in Enugu Area Office. 
and this with me is my colleague. She's the head of training, Mrs. Zaida Rosie Bukwe. And one of our other colleagues is a maker. He's actually going to be coordinating this program. You'll be seeing him more to come and see whatever you're doing within the next two months that we're going to be here. Uh, we expect that you give it the best that you can. This is practical, it's not um, a classroom thing. It's something for you to do, I see. Uh, with what you have seen on ground, I'm sure you are taking you around to see what is here. He's a professor. Also, it is not looking and he's still using his hands to do more reality in life. And these are the things we need, things we are going to feed with. So wish you all the best for the two months you're going to stay with us. And uh, like I said, give it the best that you can to the obtention. So before you leave here, that two months, you'll be able to get something out. This is for you to go home with. If you don't even want to use it to make money, you use it to feed yourself. But I pray that you use it to make money. Yeah. You know? Because, yes, money. it's making money. You know, but sometimes when you take care of your home, especially women now, you have your garden, you have everything now. Tomato and pepper and other things will be off for me, right? Yes. And yes. you can use that money to do something else. So please give it the best. I think he's going to be concentrating more on uh, tomatoes and um, from few things that he will put you through, but others we're going to do that. So let's see what we're going to get out of it and sell. Because marketing aspect will stick up. We have to talk about how you're going to dispose most of these things. So that's actually why we came here to see. Please, you're expected to be about 40 here. How many is here today? Uh, it's about 20 something. I will still check the roster because they are signed in. Okay. So we'll check the number. Okay. Uh, Please, maybe other people that you know that are supposed to be here, let them be informed. And if you stay too well, he's not going to be going back and forth. No, no. He, if, he, if he skips, if he has done for today, has finished for today, tomorrow starts another day. So don't make him drag, go back and front, because it's not the best. Instead of you going forward, somebody is just coming exactly. down, dragging you back, and making you for him to go back and say, okay, we have to go back for the benefit of those that are just joining. If he gives that benefit for this week, I think that should be enough. By next week, more serious things will come up. You are expected to have um, a transport money at the end of the program, which is supposed to come before the end of the program. We don't know how it's going to be. So maybe before the end or at the end of the program, you'll be paid 5,000 per month. That's 10,000 for the two at months the end of the at the end of it. So that's what the IT and then a little bit of something for you to start with. We don't know what it is, but we're going to give you a starter pack to pick up from. So that's what you should expect from IT. Thank you very much. Thank you. So this morning, yesterday we met, we, we went around and talked to ourselves, interacted, and then uh, to enable more people to join us, we deferred everything today. And this morning, after the interaction, we started with the industry, the information. I'll finish our plan because we don't have time. That's more time in our hands. So the is planted. So in the next seven days, We'll be moving the this into another nursery container and then from there three weeks time we're going to the field. So while the nursery is coming up, they will prepare the field. Uh, so there will be no cap at all. So likely by early March the harvest. Thank you very much. I hope you know that uh, attendance is very, very key. Because, like she said, if you skip today, you skip tomorrow. What they talk to them today, tomorrow you may not know. Then your own sibling will be different. And you'll be wondering why it's like that. It's because you have not given it all it takes. Also, we should also know that uh, this is a federal government uh, sponsored thing. And we may come back to come and see what you have done personally, individually, in your homes, maybe your farm, and all that. No matter how small your space is, you can make it with it. And I hope that you will reciprocate the gesture the federal government is giving you to learn this uh, skill. It's a skill, I hope you know. Yes. Because if you ask me now, I don't know what you have done. <laughs> if they ask me to go and plant uh, tomatoes. tomatoes, what I would do is to just go and spread. Just like we used to do in the 1940s. One million outside. You know, things like that. <laughs> but it's not like that. What he has taught you now, I don't know it. I wish we were here earlier to know it. 
and then we'll take him to our office to go and show us what. Oh, you, when you finish, you come and do your practicals. We have a space. What we were discussing. We have a space there. You come and do your practicals and teach us what we have learned. And manners also is another thing because some people, when another person is teaching you, you seem to take it uh, with levity. Uh, is it by force? Is it my own? You know, and you begin to treat Prof as if uh, he's your child. No, Prof will respect you. You have to respect Prof back so that you get to the root of what we are talking about. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go and sit down. These ones are, uh, you know, the, the other day you came, you went with some ginger. Yes, yes. These are products. Okay. From here? Mm. Yes, that's mm. ginger. This is ginger, black pepper, turmeric, black pepper, turmeric, ginger. After this program, you say, okay, I want to continue this program. What do I do? That's how you create the relationship. That's how you network with people. We have given you the address, we have given you the opportunity to know. At the end of the program, I decided to say, so I want to still know more about it. What do I do? And your family, seeing the interest you have shown, might decide to say, okay, let's see how we can help you pay this or pay that. Do you understand? It's not all about money, it's the interest, like you said. The ability to do it, that you want to do it. Farmers are the richest people in the whole world, but in Nigeria here, politicians are the richest, but it's still money. Yes, yes. The basic fact is that we need farmers to, we need, if we have food in this nation, most people will not go hungry. If I can do my little, this thing behind my garden, my park, I don't have to go and take somebody else's money or anything, because what are the things we're stealing this money so to feed and to do other things? If I can do it for myself, Operation, operation, what is it? Field the nation uh, those days that they were doing. People, everybody, that was why the federal government even gave the, uh, the permission for civil servants, everybody, to have a garden in a house. That's one thing that you are allowed to while you're working. You have a garden. So if you have learned it and you start something, please just see it as a little bit that would grow to where your heart wants it to get to. It depends on you, not him. He has. With the, he has read all of this thing. He has decided to use his hand, blessed. Not everybody. Some other people, like when we came in here the first time and we saw this compound, other people have lived in this compound. <laughs> but he came in here and decided to use it to get something out. I am planning to buy one of this to put in my own house. Yes. You, this is it bringing out fruits already. It doesn't it's have to. Drum. It's a drum. And that's how it stays. There is one, there is the, the one of the purple, there is one they kept by the side too here that brings out all these big people. You don't need a big land. You don't need a big farmhouse. Before you say you start fighting with your family, they should give me a farmland to farm. No! The behind your father's school, behind everywhere, the little thing. That's why this the, the skills is important for you to grow. No. You can start it and grow from there. So it's a good one. Thank you, sir. I, I think I really appreciate what we are seeing. And, uh, we know we will not stop at this one with you. Okay. Uh, whatever it is that ITF is looking at, the federal government will still come back to do other things because they will be the ambassadors for us. So please speak well, do well for it. The interest you show will make others come in. If you show more interest and people are seeing that those, the first set that came out and doing well, results are there. We'll do it again. We we'll started with 40. It will go more than 40. For the next one, we're going to do. So please show your interest and be punctual to it. She has told you. It's part of what we're going to look at. Don't come today, come to the tomorrow. Surely the women come today, the next day, your husband sent you out. Please beg him for these two months. Be consistent with it. Come for the program so that you will not be dragged back. I think uh, you know my time is almost it is always wrong. Okay. But well, I think just as you said, this is the federal government uh, empowerment program. One of the challenges in which we discussed yesterday is uh, the fact that most of us are coming from a very far place. And this is farm work. Farm work it needs attention. Then just come today and go go and do another thing, then maybe next month to come back. So um, we talked about a transport fare. So I think it's very um, it's a very important something that we need 
now that we are coming for this because if I, I believe that most of the people here are those that don't have something to do.